Hi guys, welcome to another Tisnet podcast. Today we have Manshi Sherawat from Delhi, and uh, she got Mumbai TSS campus MA in Applied Psychology, specialization in the clinical and the counseling practice. So, ये कोर्स के लिए जितने लोग अप्लाई कर रहे हो, टारगेट करो TSS campus. तो ये पॉडकास्ट से uh, you will be learning many things from Manshi, and you will be learning uh, many what, what types of the question ask in the interview and the. other parameters so first of all mansi congratulation and hi kaise ho sir i am good thank you so much okay so mansi is our online live class student and uh, she joined uh, for the live class and uh, preparation acche se ho gayi and finally got selected so mansi first question the moment you got got this uh, news ki bhai mera tisme selection ho gaya hai so how was the feeling uh, feeling was actually i was kind of surprised and shocked to ki how come i got selected it was one of the best feeling i i have got because i was not expecting that i'll get into the test but i was fortunate enough so i was feeling really proud of myself at that time okay so tell me about your so when you are looking out for the this <laughs> so and the psychological course so dono mein kya comparison hona chahiye aur kya skill set as a individual hona chahiye okay so i'll just say uh, it's not about the skills you should have because skills can be cultivated through time it is about the passion you should have and the uniqueness you should have for the psychology and obviously you should have the interest in the subject if you are not interested in reading people's mind behavior then there's no point of and when it comes to test one of my senior told me that they only see the uniqueness and the honesty inside you that you are completely dedicated to the test it's not just to impress them you want to go there it is because you should be there that's why you deserve a seat there so i would say it is our uniqueness and ability to learn every day that's it very great answer very genuine and the great answer okay <laughs> so coming to the next question about your preparation journey towards that tisnet exam stage 1 tisnet exam about all the section quant uh, logic english and uh, current affairs gk and current affairs okay so actually when i filled my form for test i was already preparing for cds and fcat upsc because i am i, I am like always a defense aspirant i have studied in army school and like army is like my life to be honest so when i got to know about this i was really excited to be part of it but i was scared because uh, i have heard that there are like 45000 students who apply for it and still people don't get chance to get into study there it is one of the best university in asia for the research when it comes to psychology and i applied but mm-hmm. at that time i didn't had any guidance or anything so at that time i got to know about manover and luckily there was the course going on and i joined it because of you and other sir <laughs> i got really good into count because quant was not my major or strong part you taught us lot of good tricks to tackle the questions and this time actually tisnet quant section was very tough to be honest yes, yes, correct, gk correct. that was good for me already i was already above average in that because i was preparing for it english it's good for me but quant and reasoning was one of the most tough or tackliest uh, part i would say so because of you sir i got into that <laughs> thank you thank you thank you yeah so feeling very happy ki bhai kuch to kaam aaya main thoda bahut pada pada ke chalo great so want to understand out of all the four section all the uh, three section i did there is logic in uh, club together with the quant uh, which section you found yourself very comfortable or kaun sa section lag raha tha ki bahut weak hai bahut mehnat karna padega and how you improve it so okay so for me obviously quant was the toughest section and mere ko kafi weak lag raha tha so i tried like every day i used to give at least 3 hours to quant only in order to do a better in that uh and still it was like okay okay for me i somehow managed to uh, do good in that but gk was my strong part for 20 marks in that yeah so it was very easy for me and for me it was a ritual to do a mock test every night before sleeping so that in my mind i will have the idea that tomorrow i have sections so that was it 
ओके ओके अब मॉक की बात कर लिए तो टॉक कैन यू ब्रीफ हाउ यू स्ट्रेटेजाइज योर मॉक टेस्ट एंड मॉक टेस्ट व्हेन यू स्टार्ट आई मीन कौन सा सेक्शन पहले चालू करते थे एंड विच सेक्शन लगता था कि या ये क्वेश्चन छूट गए मेरे सम सो ओवरऑल एक्सपीरियंस मॉक का क्या था बेसिकली ओके सो माय एक्सपीरियंस विद मॉक वाज एक्चुअली वेरी हॉरिबल बिकॉज़ आई नेवर यूज्ड टू गेट गुड मार्क्स इन दैट एंड आई वाज लाइक ऑलवेज getting educated that why i am not getting good marks in that so i used to start with gk because gk it's like either you know or you don't know you can't do any trickiest part in that so i used to cover gk first then i used to go with the english part because i somewhere have a command over that so i do english then reasoning and then i go to quant but uh, in most of the uh, mock i changed my strategy doing quant first and then doing reasoning but in that process i lost some questions which i already knew so this was my strategy gk english reasoning and then quant because of my weakness towards quant okay so once again i repeat pehle gk uske baad the english and quant ke section mein pehle logic wale question first then the lastly quant section you used this is what the order of attempt yes ओके इफ यू रिलेट योर मॉक टेस्ट मेनुअर मॉक टेस्ट विद द रियल एग्जाम कितना कितना हेल्पफुल था और जो स्ट्रेटजी मॉक टेस्ट में यू हैव डेवलप्ड हैव यू अप्लाइड सेम इन द रियल एग्जाम ओके सो सर आई वुड से जो मॉक टेस्ट थे दे वर मच बेटर बिकॉज़ वो थोड़े टफ लेवल पे थे एंड दे हैव गिवन द रियल सिनेरियो ऑफ द एग्जाम सो ऑब्वियसली नॉट गेटिंग गुड मार्क्स इन मॉक वाज अ advantage for me because real exam mein jab gayi i got a really good exposure and many of the questions were so relatable so similar gk ka to they were like almost 20 to 25 questions were from the course only which i took okay, so great mock test i i like i actually recommend to everyone that they should have that and they should go for it correct correct okay so do you think any kind of a uh, mistake you have done while you were you were attempting the real paper real exam of tss okay i was like under confidence at that time which people should not have because it is the exam day you have to give uh, your 100% performance so somewhere i, I panicked little bit and uh, i could have done good in reasoning and maths part matlab quant part but i couldn't do it because of the nervousness i was having at that time so we have to be really calm during the exam time correct correct so i mean that is another factor which involved in your uh, score card jis din exam hai us din agar confident yes. down ho gaya nervous ho gaya to thoda sa impact wahan pe ho jata hai to agar but yeah, ekdam bold tarike confidently ja rahe ho ki jo hoga dekhenge i'll solve <laughs> to fir wo attitude se jaoge to you can perform well and ideally woh attitude hona chahiye okay yes. coming to the interview experience of your this psychology what types of the question panelists ask you and uh, how was your overall experience okay so interview was my best because i got really good marks in interview mm-hmm. and the extempore part also so mm-hmm. actually before the interview we had this staff detail application form so it was quite different for me uh, i actually showed my interest towards military psychology and all going into the defense and also they were more curious towards that so they didn't ask me any particular question related to the psychological aspect they asked me the skills and qualities you have which you think can take you to the military and drdo and research and how we can help you in that proce- uh, process and all so actually the three things which i said in front of that, uh, them was uh, like you should have patience dedication and obviously passion and you can take it anywhere you want so they were like they didn't ask me any specific question they were all generalized questions like they are asking me migration and the effects of that then how you can contribute to world then why you want to so only you can go to abroad also you get a lot of opportunities there but then again i showed that yeah i want to serve my country and i want to be the cause of a good factor so those were the question for me extempore was quite easy and they were so good they were forming the rapport there they were making me comfortable they were asking me if i don't know i can say no completely so it's just the confidence and the honesty you should show because they can understand when you are lying or when you are not lying so that is it i gave it with full confidence at that time 
Okay, okay. How many panelists were there? So there were three. Three people. Okay. Yes. Great, great. I mean, have you attempted the maneuver mock interview? Yes, I did. So, so I had one. So how much you can relate with the real interview? Kind of add-on it given you in the real interview of the TSS. So when I gave the mock interview with the maneuver, so it was my first interview. Like I would say in my whole life. Okay. So I was. Uh, first. Huh, but it's like I'm very good with people. So yeah, mm. I'm good with people. So I. I am very comfortable in talking and all. So okay. when I gave, so they actually took it very seriously. They made the rapo. They asked me the question which normal normally they ask in the real interview. Also, they have given me the evaluation also where I was having the weak points, where I can improve more, where I have the strong command, which part I should focus more. So they gave me the detailed oriented evaluation, which helped me a lot in the main. interview okay okay so last question uh, mansi from you uh, what tips and the suggestion you want to give to upcoming year aspirant ye aisa question hai jo sabse puchte hain so according to you what tips you want to give them jo bhi course ke liye target kar raha hai chara mlr odcl xyz course acha so the tips i would give i don't have any specific tip, tips to be honest but uh, i would say why ki you should have the dedication it is a long journey because this time corona was there so it like stressed a lot so mm. in this journey people can become more frustrated demotivated and they try to give up but no you should have the patience you should must do work hard and have believe in ourselves that yeah we can do it and obviously you should be totally focused on test not like the option as a test if you are aiming for this do it your 100% okay great great so if i summarize overall uh, podcast so obviously preparation you should start your early preparation that is the one second you should thorough with the mock test and whatever learning part you are doing revi- revision part third is nothing but the interview part yeah you should be confident enough and uh, know about the courses which you are going for and uh, don't take this as an option matlab इसके लिए जाना सिर्फ इसी टारगेट करना है मुझे ओके दिस इज व्हाट द ओवरऑल पॉडकास्ट ऑफ मानसी आई होप यू मस्ट बी लर्निंग मेनी थिंग फ्रॉम द मानसी पॉडकास्ट जितने भी व्यूअर देख रहे हैं ठीक है सो दैट्स ऑल मानसी थैंक्स फॉर जॉइनिंग एंड शेयरिंग योर डिटेल एक्सपीरियंस रिगार्डिंग द टिस्नेट जर्नी फाइनली वंस अगेन कांग्रेचुलेशन यू गॉट टिस्नेट मुंबई कैंपस सो ऑल द बेस्ट फॉर योर करियर थैंक यू